coming back to my channel. It's Marie Antoinette. I'm sick. Okay, that's why I sound like this. It's probably gonna be at the end of the video as well. So just ignore that. Ignore me telling y'all twice. But yes, I'm sick, which is why I sound like this. But I really wanted to film this eye look using this beautiful pressed glitter in the um, Pro Fusion Mirage palette and it came out beautiful I used my finger and I tried to like use a brush because I find that it's really easier to work with it on your finger than it is to use a brush with these pressed pigments I wish I didn't have these nails on but I did so I just had to work with it but if you're interested in how I got this look just stay tuned and we're gonna get right into this video because your girl I'm ready to take a break already I'm so I'm so sick Stay tuned. I'll see y'all later. All right. Deuces. <laughs> Sorry about my voice again. I pulled you guys in close so you couldn't see what I was really showing you. I used the color Adventurous and Chai to kind of buff out my crease and get ready for the transitional color that I'm going to go in with Compass Cannon. And I'm also going to use some Fuego. But for now, we're just going to go with Adventurous and Chai. Color Compass and I'm putting that in my crease. And yeah. This point, I didn't realize my camera wasn't recording, and I took the color Canon and I put that a little bit tighter in the crease as well. I also want to say I'm so sorry about the light getting brighter and darker throughout all of my videos. For some reason, it just won't stop adjusting itself. Please forgive me. As always, you're going to want to make sure everything is very well blended before you move on to the next step. Blending is key, you guys. Next, as you can see, we're going to take the color Mirage, which is the color that the palette is named after. And look at how absolutely stunning that color is. I like to use my finger to apply the shade because using a brush is not easy. It is a pressed glitter and I would advise you to use your finger because you can control it better. Especially if you don't have on nails, you'll be able to control it really well. I was acting so crazy because I was just happy to record and not feel like trash because I feel so sick and so I don't know why I was so turned up, but ignore that. Now, I am not a professional makeup artist, I just love to do makeup. so. I know that my eyeshadow looks very sloppy in the beginning stages and it comes together in the end, okay? So just bear with how crazy it looks because I promise it's gonna come together. The next shade that I took was Fuego and I popped that in that crease just to give it a little brightness, you know what I'm saying? And at this point, we're done. I'ma put on my full face and I'ma come back and show you all, you know what I'm saying? Everything I got going on, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't know why I'm so turned. <laughs> look I popped some of that on the palette I popped this color mixed with this no I'm lying to y'all I mixed this color right here mixed with this color here to get this look and I put on a lip with a pink in the dead center that's how I got this nice um, I used a brown and I like to use this NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Maple Blondie 
in the center of my lips just to make it look like a a nice natural pink color because my lips are not pink <laughs> um and then popped on my lashes which i really like these lashes um uh absolute lash absolute silk lash and this uh, y'all are not gonna be able to see it oh y'all can kind of see like that to like give you guys a name but they're really cute I really like these lashes. Of course, they're not on great. What it, when is anything ever on great with me? But yeah, so I got this look using this Mirage palette. And the color that I used is Mirage after the palette. So I wanted to do a really nice look with this. Hopefully you guys really enjoyed this video. If you want to see another tutorial or just some looks on this beautiful palette, let me know and I will of course give some more videos. I actually have a few more videos coming out soon. I'm about to record a different update, so I'm trying to be way more consistent. I say it all the time, but I'm really trying and I find me saying it all the time it helps. And if I sound crazy, it's because I'm sick and I don't feel great. So I want to put on some makeup and pretend like I feel good. But if this video looks kind of like cut up and chopped, like girl, I, I'm hot right now. I'm hot and cold at the same time. I have a cold. I'm stuffy. I just got my voice back. Like, bear with me, you guys. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. And I will see y'all in my next video. Okay. Uh -huh.